So we're going to talk about the the walrus, uh, the walrus operator. So this is the walrus operator, which is available in Python 3.8 or higher. So now, what is even the use of it? So I imagine this: if I wanted, uh, usually when you declare a variable, you cannot declare a variable then use it immediately. What I mean in an expression, like if I have a statement, like here. Usually this would not be possible if without the walrus operator. It would not be possible to do this. And then again, immediately it is available to use. Usually it would not be possible. But with the walrus operator, uh, you can declare a variable within an expression and then you use it readily after declaring it and it will be available all over the code. But what am I really saying? Let's give an example. What if I had a list? I wanted to find that if the length of the list is odd or it's not odd. So what I, initially what I would do, I would say, okay, let n equal to the length of the list. Then I would say, if the modulus of 2 is equal to 1, then I print that the number of letters is this, and which is odd. Now, this is what you do ordinarily. But what if you uh, wanted to use the walrus operator? What you would do, you would say, let n, then uh, semicolon equal to the length of a, meaning that I have declared n within within the if, within this expression of if, meaning that it's now ready to use it. I don't need to redeclare it, it's already declared. And then I'm going to divide it by 2, or I mean I'll find the modulus of 2, and then if it's equal to 1, then I'll say that uh, the, the letters, uh, the number of letters is 5, of course, then, which is odd. So that's how you would use the Walrus operator. Simple like that. You, 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 in an expression, you can be able to now declare. Yeah, uh, you can be able to declare a variable in an expression. So you don't need to declare the variable on its own line, like the way I did here. You could just initialize, declare it within the expression, and use it there. And then, uh, which I think saves maybe space. Or if you wanted to write your code in fewer lines, like here, this took two lines. This took three lines. So depends on what want to do and how you find uses for it.